If you want to understand city planning in Edmonton, it's useful to start from a bird's eye view with the city plan. See, when you pick up garbage, it's because you want your city to be clean. When you shovel out front, it's because you want people to be able to get around safely. And when you volunteer in your community, it's because you've got a vision for what that community can be. You have a plan for our city in your head, how you want it to be and what choices you need to make to get there. The city of Edmonton needs that plan as well. We need a way to make sure that we're all on the same page about the city that we're building together. And luckily, we've got one. We call it the city plan. Think of the city plan as a kind of North Star for Edmontonians and for the people behind the scenes, planning everything from zoning to transit to services. It looks at what Edmonton will be in the future, a city with more trees, housing for all, and neighborhoods flourishing with local services, amenities, and attractions for all two million of us. That is the Edmonton of tomorrow. That's where we're going over the decades to come. The next question is, well, how do we get there? The city plan has four strategic goals, six guiding values, 24 city building outcomes, 60 intentions, and 250 directions, which is all a lot. But if you want to understand the big picture vision, it helps to start with the five big city moves that we have to make to get where we're going. They are greener as we grow, which is about lightening our collective footprint, a rebuildable city, which is about adapting to a changing future. A community of communities, which means strengthening our districts. Inclusive and compassionate, which means that we don't leave anyone behind. And catalyze and converge, which is about fostering innovation and creativity. While city planning can often feel like this far removed, dare we say bureaucratic process, at its heart, it's just about thinking of your home, not just as your house, or even your neighborhood, but your whole community. It's about taking that bird's eye view of where you live and taking those intentional steps to make it more adaptable, more inclusive, and more resilient in the future. Together, we're gonna build a city for everyone. We all need to do our part. That means residents, local businesses, developers, community organizations and institutions, and the city of Edmonton itself. So, across this series, we're gonna take you on a tour through how we use all of the tools in the city planning toolbox to realize that big picture vision laid out in the city plan. We're gonna dive into the district plans, zoning bylaw, and development services, and discuss some of the steps and changes needed to plan and develop our future Edmonton, as described in the city plan. Sure, some of this might be a little bit jargony, but on the other side of all that jargon is a better understanding of how our city works and how it can work even better. To find out more, visit edmonton.ca slash cityplan.